Hey everybody, it's Joe at Droman Production. Uh, today what I'm going to sit there and show you is a unboxing. I don't do the traditional unboxing. I'll sit there and unbox everything. So I'm going to sit there and show you what's inside the box. And that's what I'm going to call my video, What's Inside the Box. And today we're going to sit there and look at the Twin Otter 1.2 meter from Horizon Hobby E-Flight. We have the fuselage. We have the uh, wheels. We have some gear here. This is basically, I think this is gonna be for the uh, floats that are over here. We have the uh, props, and we have all the other stuff that has to sit there and be set up for this. And of course, we have the wing and, and the manual that'll show you everything whatsoever to uh, put this all together. It includes everything that you need except the remote and the battery okay everybody i got the twin otter all together and this is looking absolutely gorgeous look at this plane got the twin otter already programmed in to the dx6 i followed the instructions exactly the way it says to sit there and bind it very simple very easy to do okay and i have an issue about this size of the battery compartment that i do with some of these uh, Horizon Hobby models and everything whatsoever. The battery compartment always is too small. It says it recommends a 11.1 volt 33200 MAH 3S 30C Smart LiPo IC3. It's got an IC3 right here. Now, watch this. When I sit there and put it into the battery compartment, I already have the uh, uh, transmitter turned on and I'm gonna plug it in. Here we go. Put the battery inside here, and hopefully this is coming out on the camera and everything. See, you push it in, and it doesn't go all the way in. All right? And this is a bitch, this is a real bitch. So you have to, uh, I'm holding this camera head down here, and you gotta watch because this is where the uh, front wheel, the, right here is where this connects to the front wheel so you don't want to sit there and have any interference with that so i'm going to push this in and you push it in and i don't like that i don't like that at all i'm going to push this over here down inside downside there and i don't want any interference between the battery and there and i didn't put the uh what do you call it the strap around it i just want to sit there and show it to you but you have to push it down. You have to push it down inside there. It doesn't exactly fit and it pushes back inside the, the hole over here, inside there, and hopefully this is coming out right and down in there, it, oh, just like that. And then you put the, the cover, you know, the, uh, the fuselage cover on there. It has some beautiful, beautiful front lights on the side, on the wing tips. On the tail, very, very nice. This is gonna look great in the dark. Let's see if I can do that. Yep, right there. Looks awesome, awesome, awesome for uh, dusk flying or at night and everything. Yeah, it looks really, really nice. All right, and we got the flaps. All the way down, up and up. Ailerons, rudder, rudder looking nice, rudder of course obviously, oh Jesus, oh Jesus, <laughs> oh my God guys, you see that, <laughs> oh I took off, it's taking off, oh my God, hopefully everything's good, <laughs> I hit the throttle, <laughs> I went off, I apologize, that, is that, oh look at that, I got, see, this is a painted surface, and everything, you know, you sit there and bump it a little bit, boom, that's everything, but yeah, you know, we're looking good. <laughs> a little bit of there, a little bit there, yeah, nothing bad. Oh, we got a little ding there, uh, came over, eh, nothing major, I can't believe it. Didn't even take it off, I already crashed. <laughs> Sorry about that. All right, so we're going, and look at the thrust. I want to sit there and just show you here. 
Watch this. This is only a quarter thrust. Full thrust. Oop, blowing around those damn, uh, look at that, blowing everything over. It's got some power there. Got some power. Got some power there. Anyways, it is all set up. Everything here is in the manual. Got it all put together. And I didn't put the floats on. It does have some beautiful floats, as I showed you, showed you in the, uh, uh, earlier. I do only have that one issue, of course, with the battery compartment. And uh, you have to be very careful. And you want to sit there and make sure you got this secured and right. You don't want to have this uh, servo touching the battery or any of the wires or anything like that push it back and you got to pull it up and I don't like that I don't like that at all because it sits there and actually turns it sits there and touches this servo for the uh for the wheel and I don't like that so I'm gonna have to sit there and work on that part right there because they always make this battery compartment just a tad 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 small but it's an absolute wonderful plane uh, once again, this is the Horizon Hobby E-Flight Twin Otter. Beautiful plane. The manual, you get inside the box. The plane, everything you need to do to set it up. You'll need to get yourself a nice uh, Spectrum remote, at least the six channel and above. All right, talk to you soon. Any questions or anything? Thank you much. Drone Man Joe out. Being an ass. Sorry. Talk to you later. Bye.